Picture this, you update your Galaxy S24 thinking it's just another boring beta, and then suddenly your phone starts doing things it couldn't do yesterday. Features that feel almost hidden, like Samsung slipped in secret powers without announcing them. That's what makes this new One UI 8 beta so exciting. It's not just about fixes or patches, it's about unlocking tools that can actually change the way you use your phone every single day. And the wild part. Some of these tricks were supposed to stay exclusive to the newer S25, but Samsung has quietly brought them over to older devices too. Welcome back viewers, Sam here. If you're enjoying these deep dives into the world of Galaxy updates, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you never miss the next one. So, what exactly is hiding inside this update? Let's start with something that feels straight out of a movie audio eraser V2. Imagine recording a clip at a busy street corner, cars honking, people talking, random background chaos, and with one tap, all of that melts away, leaving only your voice. It's like having a sound engineer living inside your phone. Samsung first tested this on the S25, but now it's been polished, made faster, and given a dedicated toggle in One UI 8. For creators, vloggers, or anyone who just wants their videos to sound clean, this is a huge deal. The second surprise is call captions. Think about being in a loud environment where you can barely hear what the other person is saying. Or maybe you're someone who struggles with hearing altogether. Flip this feature on, and the other person's voice shows up as live captions on your screen in real time. It's an accessibility tool, sure, but also one of those quality of life upgrades that makes calling simpler for literally everyone. Once you use it, you'll wonder why it wasn't there all along. And then comes the feature Galaxy fans have been waiting months for now brief. Last year, Samsung kept it exclusive to the S25 series, but with this beta, it's finally on the S24 lineup. This isn't just another notification summary. It's an AI-powered daily briefing that feels personal. It tells you what matters, cuts out the noise, and even comes with an audio mode that reads it out for you, almost like your own assistant. And if that wasn't enough, it now syncs with YouTube to recommend longer, smarter video suggestions right inside the briefing. Now, beyond the flashy features, this update is also bringing serious stability. The build labeled ZYHB is around 900 MB, and it doesn't just squash bugs. It ships with the September 2025 security patch, sealing up one critical loophole and multiple vulnerabilities. That means your phone isn't just smarter, it's also a lot safer. But remember, this is still beta software, so bugs and hiccups are part of the ride. Only jump in if you're comfortable with a little instability. Otherwise, the stable version is coming soon with the S25 release in September. And here's a little teaser for what's next. Samsung isn't stopping with the S24. The S23 series, the Z Flip 5, and the Z Fold 5 are all lined up for the beta with rollout rumored as early as the first week of September. So if you're rocking one of those, keep your eyes peeled. What's happening right now is bigger than just another update. Samsung is slowly breaking down that old wall where new features only lived on the latest hardware. For once, older flagships are getting the same love as the new ones. That could be a sign of where Galaxy software is headed, more inclusive, more AI driven, and more about keeping you hooked long after you buy the phone. So the real question is, are you going to test, drive this beta now and live with the quirks, or are you waiting for the Polish stable release in a few weeks? Either way, this update proves that One UI 8 is more than a skin. It's Samsung's next big leap in making your phone feel alive. Thanks for hanging out with me today. And if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to hit that like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe to the channel because trust me, you don't wanna miss what's coming next.